Welcome back. Well, kids in the borderland are back in school, but not all of them have everything they need, including school clothes. Operation School Bell is a local program looking to fix that. And here to talk to us a little bit about how you can help are Priscilla Constantino and Jennifer Bucknowski. Thanks so much for joining us, ladies. Thanks for having us. Of course. So first of all, just talk to me a little bit about what this program does, what you all usually do. Um, primarily, the most... Uh, um, biggest philanthropic of the program is Operation School Bell, which is um, we provide new clothing for um, children in need here in El Paso. Um, we, uh, we provide them for um, El Paso County school children. Um, and talk a little bit about the selection process and how you determine which kids get the help. Sure, we, um, we actually work directly with school counselors and school nurses. Um, so we're, we're looking at kids um, first through fifth grade and those children are kind of handpicked by the administration and then they're sent to us on the school bus and they get to pick out all their clothes and try them on and have just the best day. And so I, we've covered these events before, and it really is great to see these kids. They're so excited. They're so mm -hmm. happy to get these basic things. I mean, we're talking uniform shirts, mm -hmm. uh, pants, underclothes. Mm -hmm. I mean, really just special for right. them to have what right. they mm -hmm. need. Absolutely. And so you guys are looking to kind of expand this program and keep it going. And so there are two big events that are coming up. The first, yes. first ever, right? Yes. yes. Talk a little bit about the events. <laughs> we're doing a uh, golf and um, gala event uh, at Coronado Country Club. It's on September 22nd and 23rd. The gala... Um, is um, going to be a great night. It's a way we're, we're using it as an opportunity to celebrate the organization. And the golf tournament is going to be um, uh, on the, on the uh, Monday, which will be great. It's going to be super fun. It's a way to raise awareness. So, this is, so the, uh, the, the golf tournament is happening the next day. This is September 23rd, 1 p.m. at the Coronado Country Club. $500 per team. So this is a pretty reasonable price to play mm -hmm. for a, you know, a, game, a day of golf right. and for such a great cause right. to help the kids in our community. Right. How did this program get started? How did, you, how did you guys come together to create something like this? Um, well, the organization has been, actually, has been um, in, since 1967 here in El Paso. Mm -hmm. um, we have 122 members, all volunteers, non-profit. We have no payroll. And it's a, just a very tremendous, uh, uh, it's a great uh, group of women that work um, and, you know, they do a phenomenal job. Of doing lots. And then yeah. so the idea, um, so we're looking at some video of these past events. So uh, these are some of the kiddos here that get the items. So this is a pretty elaborate setup that right. you guys have taken care of. What was the idea behind this golf tournament in Gala? We really wanted to reach out to the community to get them involved as best we could. And we figured what better way to both celebrate what Assistance League does and what we're able to provide the community than to invite them to celebrate the uh, achievements of Assistance League and then also to just have a good time celebrating, you know, what it is that we do. Absolutely. So let's go ahead and take a look at that information again. We have those graphics for the gala, September 22nd, 6 p.m. Coronado Country Club. A table for $1,000 or an individual seats for $100. Then the very next day, of course, uh, the Golf for Kids tournament at the Coronado Country Club. So they can reach out to the Assistance League of El Paso for registration for those right. events, yes. correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, ladies, for Thank coming you. in. Thank you so much. We'll be right back. We'll have one final look at your forecast after the break.